Hello everyone, this is Sonia Bergman. It's been more than a month since our last video, and I had reasons for that. I was preparing something really interesting for you, and as always, everything did not go according to what I wanted. In this video, I will show you how to make your own dishes, and now I don't need a glass blowing shop or a kiln for this. Everything you can see can be done at home. So polymer clay has become the main material. Such clay doesn't need to be fired, and it dries itself upon contact with air. To make free plates in the same style, I needed a kilogram of clay. I wedged the clay well so that it warms up a little, then the products will not crack. Next, we need the plate of the required size, which will become a kind of shape for our future products. However, you can easily give free rein to imagination and create something unusual simply by giving the desired shape with your hands. These are the plates we got. I sent paper the surface with medium-sized grain. Uncoated polymer clay is quite pliable. Now it's time to color items. I will be using made acrylic paint. This is not the final coating, so there is no need to worry about the potential toxicity of the future product. All our plates will be in the same style, with a floral pattern. If you are not sure, you can first sketch the drawing with a simple pencil, and then cover it with paint. All this fits perfectly on the clay surface. How to make plates durable and waterproof? I came up with a completely unusual solution – to coat the products with epoxy resin. Yes, you can use it not only to paint pictures and make jewelry. Epoxy resin hardens on almost every surface except silicone. Therefore, I use an ordinary silicone brush for application. The idea to use resin is brilliant. But difficulties awaited me immediately. First, there are several types of resin, depending on the purpose of the work. Since I never worked with epoxy, I had a bit of failures. The resin I chose turned out to be too liquid. I had to cover small areas with it and wait until it dries, so that there were no smudges. The resin applied in a thin layer, hardened in only 24 hours. That's why it took me so long. Another disadvantage when working with epoxy resin is that sometimes the resin gives off a yellowish tint. That's why my plates, when completely dry, eventually acquired the effect of aging, although I did not initially plan this. While, on the other hand, epoxy resin is very durable. Such plates are not afraid of scratches and small chips. They can be safely washed, but you should still refuse to use the dishwasher. It's not known how the epoxy resin will behave when exposed to high temperatures. So, it was a difficult but interesting project. I'm not sure that you will want to repeat my experiment, but I hope that it will push you to new ideas. This is the beauty of creativity. Your possibilities are endless. Do not forget to support me, put a like on this video and subscribe to the channel. I will definitely surprise you.